Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I am Madden Gaming, and I got a little XFL reaction that I'm gonna be doing. This is the showcase. Hopefully, this video does not get blocked worldwide. I don't know. I'm taking a little risk with this, and I just want to see what the showcase is about. And without further ado, let's hop into it. When you're looking at this, Coach Rock, what are you looking for? Right now, we're looking at skill set. We're looking at agility. We're looking at speed quickness but also looking at the grit that's what you're looking at the grit how they finish the drill how they run through because everybody is coachable they've all been tested they've all battle, been battle tested and let's take a look at don't guess don't guess running through but it's that kind of extra effort that we look for too because that will that will that indicates uh, the kind of effort that you're going to get down the line. When you're tired, you're breathing heavy, you feel like you got go. nothing left in the tank, it's that extra effort. Don't go, don't go. Don't shuffle, man. Don't shuffle. Come to me. Well, Coach Prime is doing such great things here at Jackson State. I think he's already done such a tremendous job uh, in under uh, three years, I think, um, just barely. And I think what he's already, um, what he's already brought to this university, the community, and not only that, but then uh, opening the eyes uh, to recruiters, coaches, professional leagues. There's talent here. Don't overlook us. And also, I mean, Coach Prime is one of the greatest, if not the greatest of all time. So you have the GOAT who made it. He made his money. He saved his money. Uh, it's something at this point in his life he didn't have to do. He could ride off in the sunset. He could go bass fishing <laughs> every day, which I love because I love to fish too. But he chose to dedicate his life to these kids. So I admire that about Coach Prime. You know, and I'm a Miami guy, a Florida State guy. But when I was coming up in high school, trying to decide where I was going to go to school, Florida State was one of those schools. I was recruited by Bobby Bowden, uh, and but of course I wound up at Miami. But I mean, Coach Prime, he was the man. I remember him at Doak Campbell Stadium, just doing this, just doing this, just doing this. I'll never forget that. Oh um, man, I just think it gives them another great opportunity to showcase their talent. Uh, but also give them another avenue to make it in a professional league. And you know, uh, with this being held at Jackson State, it, it's still in the swag, it's still in Mississippi. And with the presence of Dwayne Johnson, his international player, what does it mean for Valley State, for Jackson State, for the spotlight to be on Mississippi? Uh, great. It's a great opportunity, like I said, um, just to have this big showcase and to have these professional guys, um, whether it's Dwayne Rock and uh, even Coach Prime, to be here and uh, be witnessing some of these, these opportunities, man. I think this shines a spotlight on HBCU, but not only HBCU, but all the, the, the Mississippi school for these guys to be able to be here and be able to um, showcase their talent. I think it's a great opportunity, man, and I, I appreciate those, those people for hosting this and having this for these young men. Well, guys, I want to give my general thoughts on that. I love what The Rock was saying and giving these guys the opportunity to reach their ultimate goal, which is the NFL, which that's something I love with the USFL. It's not really anything I can say. They didn't really show anything. I know there is one on their official page, but like I said, I don't even know if this video is going to be able to go out worldwide, and I'm hoping it will, but I don't really want to risk reacting to videos on their channels because football channels, basketball channels, all that. They tend to like to block things. That's what happened with the USFL. Uh, a couple games into the year, they just went to block everything. So we're going to see about this one. Love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next one.